I'm going dumb with the dope rhyme In the club, I just shimmy, let my soul shine You ain't got an envy when you all time They trying to make it on this side, but it's tall climb I came dripping out the jungle, it was roll tight Devil trying to hit me with the clothesline But I limboed out the trap, way too nimble Okay, hey guys Today is Thursday We have not recorded I don't know if Sandra has, but I haven't really been recording this week. It's been a pretty busy week. I had like scholarships due and stuff like that. Okay, yeah. I had scholarships due and stuff like that. Um, what's it called? Just like meetings, um, so I don't know if Santa told you guys, but um, we did run for, um, like, Santa ran for VP, I ran for executive, and also um, student representative for the Resident Housing Association, and Sandra got VP, and I got um, student representative. Yeah, student representative, so that's good. Um, so Monday was pretty intense. Um, we stayed there forever because, like, the whole voting thing. Um, then today, Sandra, um, she's still at Columbine right now. It's like it's 9 08, so she's at one of the buildings. She has she's a writing fellow which if you guys don't know what that means is you're basically like a writing helper or like assistant for different like college students for a particular class so she's doing that she had a lot to do today so she, that's why she didn't come to BSU which is Black Student Alliance I went um it, it ran to like I it's supposed to run to 8 30 but I left a little early just so I don't have such a late dinner. After that, um, after I got here, I had to walk um, because I didn't. I think the bus was coming at like eight thirty something, but like it was like eight fifteen. I was like, I might as well just walk. So I walked, and then I ate my dinner, and then I called my mom because she called me. And right now. Um, I was thinking about tomorrow because I have work in the morning at 8. So I'm making me and Sandra some breakfast burritos because did Sandra show you guys? I don't know. This week has been a blur, but I don't know if Sandra showed you. She made banana bread, which was so good. It was like, so it's like bananas, like real ripe bananas, and then a cake mix. So if you don't want to call it banana bread, but that's what I'm going to call it banana bread. That was good, and luckily we kept a little bit for our dad because he said he wanted some. And then tomorrow, after I get off of work, we'll be going to um, going back home. So excited for that! We got. I need to. I honestly want to go to the store, but I don't know if I have time. Um, yeah, go back home, and then our mom said she bought like some shrimps and stuff, so we might have a seafood boil again. Um, what else? Yeah, right now I'm making just breakfast burritos. So, if people who are in college are watching this, if you have a kitchen, and if you don't have like a food plan or whatever, but we do have a food plan, but we still meal prep. I know some people think like it's expensive, but it's actually not. If you actually write stuff down, write a list. And not just stuff like not stuff that you want, like stuff that you need. As for like food, you can like spend like under fifty dollars at Walmart. Me and Center are two, so the last time we went, it was like a hundred dollars right then and there. But there was also like toiletry and stuff like that, so it was like under a hundred dollars, and that's gonna last us for at least two weeks. So that's a good thing. Um, and we're gonna get our hair done this week. I mean, this weekend, I'm so happy. Like, I like my hair. Like, this is cute or whatever, but mm -mm. it's getting cold. 
and so y'all know we live in Colorado. I mean, the weather is like on and off, but this week it has been cold a little bit, and I don't feel like doing my hair. What else? I don't know. What else? Getting our hair done. Happy to see our go and see our parents. That was the oven. Here. I'm just making two. We're not. I'm not doing too much because we're leaving tomorrow, and plus we still have meal prep food. I think there's only two more left, so hopefully I can finish it. Hopefully, I don't know. We might be able to. Um. And yeah. to my advisor meeting which is my outfit this is one of my last like summer slash fall outfits because it's about to snow this week but yeah got this jacket you guys saw i think on our trial haul and these jeans from fashion nova and these shoes um are really cute and they're um got them from liberia when my dad went back there. So um, I'm about to go eat um, breakfast and I'll just walk to the uh, like um, place where my advisor meeting is. Um, I'll be just talking about like, the study bar trip classes that um, might transfer over just to have like a few different options. Um, I did my nails, um, what's it called, yesterday, um, I'll get better at it, what's it called, I keep doing them, so, yeah. We have had a long night, it's literally about to be 12, just now eating dinner, I got some things from H&M. And we already put our groceries and stuff up, but dinner y'all. Okay, so good morning guys. Today is Sunday, not Sundays, today is Saturday. Um, I am doing this volunteer, um, it's this volunteer thing for this nonprofit organization. Um, it's like science based, so they do a lot of different like science experiments and get kids excited about science. So they're doing it on campus, so I'm going to be volunteering. Um, I think it's 10 to 6, not, not, no, 10 to 4, so it's about 6 hours, and I wanted to come and show you guys, um, this, like, yogurt parfait thing that I'm gonna make, um, oh, I forgot the strawberries, and we have blueberries, too, but I think I'm gonna just do strawberries, um, yeah, so we're going to, I'm going to be like meal prepping um, yogurt parfaits kind of with like oatmeal. But today since, I mean, I need to eat right now, I'm going to just do some Greek yogurt. So it's Greek vanilla yogurt. We'll try this out. I know Greek yogurt is more on the tart side, so we'll see. We have some French vanilla almond granola. Some strawberries. And then some sugar-free honey. So yeah, let's get this going. Hopefully this is good. We have regular yogurt too, because Tamara said she was not doing the Greek yogurt. So. This is Greek yogurt. I'm not gonna do too much for right now because I have half of a bagel. So I think I'm gonna just do, yeah. I'm gonna just do about this much of the yogurt. Just to like try it out. Mm, that's actually not bad. And now that I think of it, I've, I actually enjoy Greek yogurt, especially when you do it with like, yo um, what is it called, smoothies. That's what I was doing last semester when my mom had got some. So 
I'm gonna just take some of my Greek yogurt. I might not even need the honey. It's a granola. Not too much. I want some texture. It's kind of raw. As I say, not too much. I pour in the whole thing. I wash a couple strawberries. And slice them up in here. Sorry, guys, you guys can't see this. I should probably make it smaller, but I'm kind of running a little behind schedule because I just wanted to walk there. It's like on the other side of campus rather than take my car there. I might have to take my car there. Yeah, I might just do that. I might just do that. So this is how it looks, guys. It looks really good. Mix all that up. And then I'm going to put a little bit of this honey. Just a little. Because I got the vanilla flavor yogurt so it's not like super you know that bad, super bad. Do a little bit of honey I don't know if you guys can tell and that is that guys okay hey guys so this is the shirt um for the event that i've been volunteering at it's basically like a science event so we've been doing like a sound waves boost and i'll show you guys like some of the um different things that we've been doing but there's like so many so many people yeah so this is the food it's like a ham sandwich cookies some chips i just wanted to vlog everything um well not everything but vlog my food i was thinking we we're gonna have pizza or whatever but this will work y'all i am starving um so yeah Hey guys, um, we just came from church. Yeah. Um, one of my um, classmates from school, she was, we like um, talk a lot and stuff. She was telling me about her church. So we came and we visited her church and we actually really liked it. Yeah, it was really nice. Yeah, I like their worship. I'm mm -hmm. like a worship person. Like, yeah. I like my worship. Mm -hmm. A good but worship enjoy, service. Yeah. yeah. And yeah, and his um, sermon was good. It was pretty good. Mm -hmm. It was just like I can't like the. I wish they would put the like the scriptures on, on the, the board. board so I yeah. can like look at it. But next time I'll bring like my journal or something so I can just write it down fast and yeah, you have to scribble kind of to get yeah. all the notes because like like most pastors, you know, they have their points and stuff. Our pastor at our church, he like has a script for people. Kind yeah, of. for you to like fill it out and stuff. Yeah, but it was pretty. It was good. Mm -hmm. I liked it. I'll be coming back. Yeah, definitely. Oh, yeah, and the, and the songs were good. The girl up there, she can sing, like, sing, yeah. sing. Like, not just she just singing for the girl, <laughs> the girl can sing. <laughs> That's yeah. funny. And it's, like, diverse, which is really important for us. Yeah. So. The message was, like, um, about... Angels. Yeah. And how to... Not kind of, like, how to release them, but, like, how speaking positive and speaking of the lord mm -hmm. and don't hinder angels by like fussing complaining and stuff like that yeah so i'll be reading more more of his like the chapter because yeah. he just like did like a couple points but i mean his thing it was like engaging because i know a lot of some now a lot of pastors are like trying to like connect it to like the world so you kind of yeah. like, get it more because mm -hmm. so. it's hard to it can be hard to dissect the bible and to like and understand it or like see it in the real world mm -hmm. but it's there um next time i'll probably invite yasmina yeah that would be nice yeah see you guys this is our little we should have showed them our outfits I know. Outfits maybe we cute. can show you guys once this car by us get back well it's twelve thirty-five, so hopefully we can make it to the dining hall Oh, okay. Bye, guys. <laughs> <laughs>
showed you guys our outfit. We're actually at a Ross. <laughs> we we're passing by. Well, we we're looking for like a grocery store um, to get some eggplants. And we saw peppers. that. Because King Super is just like right across. We saw that there's a Ross. So we're going to check it out. I think it's a new one too. Because it says now open. So we're going to see how it is. Okay, guys. This is one of the shirts that I got from Ross. Um, we didn't get to show you guys. And it was only $7.99. And then Tamara and I both got this blouse. It has like sport flare with little pearls on the front. And this is awesome. So, yep, guys.